Okay, so, uh, this is my hair. Um, that's the camera. <laughs> Look at the camera, please. If I was to do, if I was to do, um, if I was to just do a X Damers, X, X, wow, okay. Yeah. Interesting. Being a smidge drunk on tequila doesn't help you extemporaneously say things. If I was to start doing, if I was to start doing a comedy set right now, if somebody said, hey, get on Sunday and do a little comedy set, I would go like this. I would go, hey, welcome ladies and germs. <laughs> germs. Germs. Ladies. Germs. Ladies don't like germs. <laughs> they don't, they don't like germs. And yet, we are all come from germs. <laughs> we're all ger we're all we're all created from a germ, you know, because an egg is like a seed. A seed is a germ. It gets germinated. Germination. Okay, right? And people, you know, they don't like Germany. Uh, as we know, it's been said a thousand times. I'm not breaking any fresh. No fresh land is being plowed here. <laughs> don't mention the war. Uh, Faulty Towers, 1975. Um, John Cleese. Um, don't mention the war. Germany, Germany, germination. Is that now? Is Germany? Did Germany when they invented Germany? Was that what they were thinking? I don't know. Okay, look it up. I should look it up. <laughs> you could look it up. <laughs> look it up now. Look it up now. Oh my God! Of course, there's that too. The germs of an idea, you know. And yet, ladies and germs. Ladies, ladies don't like germs. Uh, I've met some ladies that are more comfortable with germs than others, you know. Uh, camper, camper ladies. <laughs> I've met camper ladies. Um, they you want to shop at REI, right? I don't know what REI means, Recre Recreation Entertainment Institute or something. Um, again, good looking up. All these things that come into your head, like there's like an initials for something. What, is, what does that even mean? TWA, that's not, forget it. Don't even worry about TWA. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm amused. See what I'm saying? I'm amused. Okay. Now I'm gonna tell a joke. When I was eight years old, I happened to, for the first time, sadly, to my own shock and horror, walk in on my parents. You know them. You know what I walked in on. They were, they were playing pinochle. <laughs> just an old, just an old card game referenced in '30s and '40s comedy. Um, <laughs> I'm not just old. I'm. I knew old things. When I was a little kid, I knew old things. When I was 12 years old. Here's an old end. When I was 12 years old, Groucho Marx was still alive, okay? Groucho Marx died the same week that Elvis Presley died. That's how old I am. But I was 12 years old, dressed as Groucho Marx, going door to door, you know, for Halloween to get candy. I was given candy. I was given candy. I don't, I don't know if I remember if I had a cigar, if I just pretended that I did. I can, you know, I still, and I, and, and, and I've dressed up as Groucho several times since then, and I've yet to really memorize any good Groucho stuff. I just go, oh, you know, I make it up, you know. I once actually won $50 dressing as Groucho. Um, dressed as Groucho. Oh, I dressed as Groucho specifically, I believe, to go to a Halloween party, but then me and the woman, I have this weird, shaky memory of it. I have this weird, shaky memory of me and a woman leaving the party that we were at and going to a bar and that at the bar they were doing a, a, um, a contest right so i walk in and they were like a gist they were like oh we're gonna do the con we're gonna announce who the winner is we walked in we're there for like 10 minutes you know we get a cocktail we're there you know 15 minutes in and they say oh we're gonna do we're gonna announce the winner of the you know and uh, so I figured, like, if they're going to announce a winner in, in, in five minutes, uh, I have five minutes. So I, like, go around. I don't know who the judges are. I just go around to everybody. I just get into my whole thing. I get, hey, I don't know. I 
Could I have a lock of your hair? A lock of my hair? <laughs> you ought to consider yourself lucky. I was going to ask for the whole wig. Okay, do my whole, you know, and, um... <laughs> At the time, I think I knew some more Rocho stuff. Um, you know. <laughs> but, so, you, I'm, literally, we're there a half hour total tops, right? And they announced the thing, and there was a guy who was dressed as Mr. T. It was a cool, it was good looking, but he didn't nail it. He didn't nail it. I'm saying, he didn't nail it. It was good, but he didn't nail it. But he, he'd been there all night, and he, he, he somehow felt like we tied. It was a $100 prize, and we tied. And he looked at me like, when did you, just, when did you even get here? <laughs> yeah, so if I was to extemporaneously do some comedy, I need to have jokes prepared. So I'm going to try to do that, okay? I'm going to try to prepare some jokes, all right? And I'm doing this with a... See what I'm doing here? This is me holding a microphone, right? In case I have to do that. I want to... You know what? Sometimes when you go on Letterman... I've heard Letterman. It's a show from before times and from the before times. You go on the Colbert... I don't know if they have comedians on there. I don't watch those shows anymore. But you go on like the Jimmy Kimmel or what have you, they just like walk out and there's like a boom mic over the person's head and you just walk out and they look, they like step on a mark and they look to camera, you know? And they just, but they also have an option. I don't know if they still do, but they used to back in the day, they used to have this option of like they put a microphone stand there. Mic microphone stand, right? And so then, you know, because a lot of comedians, you know, they have that. They need it. They need the thing. You know, they need to be like, bong, tong, 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 you know. <laughs> and then my mother's coming up the stairs, tong, 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 you know, and whatever. You know, they make that little thing. Um, but I think it would be really hilarious if, <laughs> if they did it with, you don't have a microphone, right? But you pretend that you think you do. So you walk out, you walk on the stage, you go, all right, hi, welcome. Yeah. <laughs> Put the mic stand over here. Yeah. <laughs> huh? All right. Anyway, how long was that? How long did I just talk? How long did I just talk? Ooh, that was seven minutes, ladies and gentlemen, seven minutes of me just extemporous, extemporaneously, extem learning how to pronounce the word extemporous, extem, extemporous, extemporous, extemporan, extemporan, extemporous, extemporaneously, extemporaneously. Whew, wow, that's not always the best word. I bought some tequila today. Here, this is this is what happened. Okay, there. Now you want you want to know the truth? That's what happened. I bought that and I bought that. Okay, there you go. You you now now you know. Okay, I was out in the world. I went to a really I went to like a discount liquor store. I found that. I was gonna buy the Casamigos because it's yummy. Then I bought this because it was like twenty dollars less. It's it's in there yummy as the Casamigos for twenty.